Welcome back to the House of the Quiet Giraffes. Things are great. Poop is clean or non-existent. Bellies are full of food and not poop. And faith is high. That's a pretty solid summary, I would say. We, uh, we're on the full build now. And that's exciting. So I'm, I don't know what kind of changes are in, but I'm expecting like new perks, different drops, that kind of stuff. Uh, but who knows? Who, who really, who really knows anything these days? All right, let's begin. What do we got here? Tempest Gauntlets 4. Have not seen these yet. A set of deadly spiked gloves. Weak at first, but devastating on a complete combo. Well, that's already new. And Death Sweep is also new. Devastating melee attack that can be charged for increased power. Interesting stuff. Let's go. Okay, let's start hitting here. So the combo I imagine is like right there. Oh, I didn't read the thing. Who cares, right? Okay. Just hit, hit, just keep hitting. It's always a good tactic. Oh, I see. I actually like that. If I can routinely get kills in three hits, pretty solid. Now, I'm wondering, uh, for those of you that are, well, I guess when this comes out, I think it will be release day or maybe the day before. I'm curious to know, like, if you're playing on, um, hold on. Oh, okay, I gotta get focused here. Oh, this is like the exploding thing that we had at the very beginning, I think. The range is actually longer than it looks. Okay. I'm curious to know about resource generation. I was watching some streams. I didn't catch the difficulty that people were playing on. Um, but, like, people had so much wood and stuff early. And I have to imagine that's, that's based on difficulty. But um, one thing I do want to do today... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. One thing I do want to do today is improve our resource generation at base. Man, I'm getting whacked here. So that means setting up some of the uh, wood generators. I don't know if I'm using the right terminology there. Uh, some of the stone generation. And then I'd like to get another farm going as well. Let's see how that goes. Ooh. That's new. Man, I am taking some lazy hits here. I'm going to have to get focused up. There's a couple other areas I want to explore in here, but let's see where this goes. Oh. That'll do. Probably missing some tarot rooms, maybe a weapon room or something. I got stars here. Yeah, let's go. Okay, fire projectile when you swing your weapon. 10 second cooldown or shield of faith buffed. When attack, 20% chance of negating damage. I feel like the 10% is so low, because, like, I can't even get hit 10 times without dying, unless I'm generating more health. 20% is a little better, but I don't know if I want to rely on that. It's a tough one. I'll take it. Let's try it. Let's try it. Maybe I'm just underestimating its strength. Oh, look at that. Meat. Meats. I don't know if I'm going to get... Whoops. A couple of command stone fragments. Yeah, what a sweet room. Hello. I don't know that I'm going to be able to get back in time to build that outhouse. Man, to complete the quest. We're just in our first little dungeon. Okay, now... Let's think about this. <laughs> Let's think about it. I could get a 
Cultist here. I can get rocks here, which I like. Merchant there. Uh, let's go rocks. Let's go rocks. Also, there's gold in them there, Nugs. Okay. That also speeds us up a little bit. So maybe I can get back before the outhouse thing expires. Let's go, baby. We're at 44 stone right now. Oh, there we go. Oh, and it leaves some extra stuff. Oh, no, maybe that was them. I think it was. Okay, projectile that spreads black ichor. Yep, we'll try that. Oh, <laughs> for some reason I thought we were getting both. I don't know why I thought that. I didn't even check the other one, it was probably amazing. We'll have to check our mushroom stash after. Okay, right there, I've got eight. So I need two more, I think, to turn them in. He doesn't look too thrilled. Not so long ago that we cast out the Red Crown, a mere thousand or so years. The heresy it preached could not be tolerated. Such noxious ideals, it could not be allowed. For this most damning of sins, the retribution must be slow and painful. I cast a famine upon your cult. And with greed and ambition unchecked, it grew, or it drew godly blood. Oh no! Oh, he's making them hungry. Everyone's starving. Okay, so that means that this run is going to be cut a little short, perhaps. Oh my god. Might be cut short for a lot of reasons. Oh my god. I need a heart bad. Oh, there we go. I do, I do feel like the game kind of uh, helps you when you're low health. Okay, let's see if I can get a hint of what this room is. Oh, nice, tarot room. Go, 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 go. Cons curses consume less fervor, 20% more damage during the day. What? I don't know what time we are. Oh, good, good. I've got like half a day left. Oh my god! Hearts, please. Nope. Okay, I'm smelling trouble. Smelling trouble. If I do die, it'd be interesting to learn what we keep and what we don't. Oh, come on. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Thank you. Bonus resources. Great. Okay, we're just barely hanging in there. Please accept our sacrifice and bless us with fertile soils and bountiful harvest. Keep the famine at bay. What 
What is that thing flashing there? I don't know if that I might be a glitch. Okay. Oh, they're not ending. Damn it. Just had to take that last hit, didn't I? Yeah, rescued all right. I should have an extra bed, but I'll, I'll have to double check because I've learned the hard way that if we indoctrinate before having the bed, it's bad news. Okay. <sighs> Gotta focus. All right. Let's do it. Heart? Oh, sick. I guess I'm not understanding what that little shield icon is. I don't think we've seen that before today. That's weird. Okay, looks like we have Taro here. Weapon damage increase? Yes. That's weapon damage plus. We are heading into nighttime, so we lose that original buff. Oh my god, I think I'm going down here. Whoo! I don't know why. I'm having a hard time just avoiding the easiest of hits. Oh my god. Rip. Okay, well, we learned something. Let's see what we lose. Okay, so we lose... Okay. So we lose a fraction of what we brought in. 30% of new items. Okay, I, I mean... I actually don't feel horrible about it. If you're not, if you are my chosen vessel and death cannot halt you, I shall not allow it for I still have need of you. Take what you've gathered, build and strengthen the cult. This is how power is gained. Continue on undaunted. Each time you're brought down, your eyes again stronger. Okay. So lose a portion of what we bring. It seems like we get to keep our main things, like the follower that we gain and stuff. Your death made you think your followers are weak. Yeah, fair enough. Um, okay. Hold on. We'll make this. And this, just to get something going. And then I can build the outhouse in time, but I need to get these people fed. Kaz is leaving? You're kidding me. My right hand man? I gotta put him in the prison. And he is not gonna like that. I'm not gonna like it either, buddy. Kaz? Oh, hold on. How is this prison? Oh. Okay, let's re let's re-educate, and then I can probably release him. Hello. 
Welcome back. Kaz, go. <laughs> Not bad. We'll see you tomorrow. And let's get another outhouse here. If I can. Oh, wait. Am I short? I think we queued up enough beforehand. I'm, I'm one short. So I'd like to build more of these. I need that. I have eight people. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight teepees. Which means I'm going to need to do a little more work. Before we recruit that guy. I also, I need to look at that tech tree. Let's see if there's a way we can get people to pick these berries for me. Hey, you. Turn that frown upside down. Nice. Also, uh, Artie, what do you do here? So you're good at work speed and gaining faith when people are sacrificed. What if I were to give you a tr uh, gift here? I've got that thing where they won't sleep. Enjoy. We also, we need to get some higher quality ingredients going. Maybe pumpkins. No longer starving. Love that. Big faith boost there. Oh, I bet you I have to empty those outhouses, don't I? Those look very oxygen not included. That little meter. Okay, let me see what I can make with these pumpkins. Paltry pumpkin soup. So, 5% chance of causing illness and diarrhea. I don't love that. Like, I'm okay with the instant poops. What else do I need here? Tasty fish. I could go fishing. That's one thing we haven't done in a long time. So maybe I try and prioritize that today. Since we had a shorter run. There's all my poops. Oh, can I get an outhouse? Oh, it's going to be really close. Come on. Oh, it's just, just failed. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Collect Camellia. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. Now somebody was old. I'm going to I'm going to do this. I'm going to place a body pit far away. I'll eat this. Let's do a cleaning run here. And then I want to build a TP Recruit. Gotta have a sermon. I guess I should queue up like... Well, actually, let me make sure I can build the, the housing that I want first. Oh, I need to... I actually need to build this on a sleeping bag. I didn't even notice that. Okay, well... They're all grouchy. Okay, let's sermon it up right now. I feel like I might be here for another day. Maybe we could do one of those feasts. Although we just did one recently. I don't know what the cooldown is going to be like. Okay, so we're into this higher level. 
Increase the starting level of weapons when you begin a new crusade. That'll be... That'll be helpful. Maybe we're right where we're supposed to be. Oakley, okay, Oakley, okay, Oakley. Okay. Let's do a new doctrine. We have two of these actually. Um, let's do sustenance. All cult members gain the cannibal trait, plus five faith when eating meal made from follower meat, or they'll gain the grass eater. No negative faith when a follower eats a meal made from grass. Oh, hell yeah. That seems great. Uh, follower meat, maybe if you're if you had a super large cult. kind of rituals do I have available here? Okay, so food's on cooldown. We could ascend someone. Maybe that's what I should do for our old guy. Or we could just do a bonfire. For 10 wood, though. Let's go see who's old. Where do I see my... My followers here. Age 49. Huh. Who said they were going to die? I can't remember. I don't think it was Kaz. I want to say it was K9. Oh, wait. It actually said... Yeah. Huh. Quest failed. That sucks. I missed that. So close. Okay, I'm just going to let it do its thing. Let's do a little loyalty buffing here. It's been a minute. I think it's him that's old. Yeah, old age. I've lived a good life of service, but now I grow weary. <laughs> uh, Agent K9. Let's do this. Grow your strength, unlock new abilities and weapons. Or all followers gain loyalty. Let's ascend them. I like how they're even a little slower to get into the sermon. Oh, you can see the percentage buffs there. That's cool. You're gonna love this! Nobody touched that. And there's my follower meat. Okay. Well, now I can actually recruit. Let's do that. Okay, you are going to be... Dr. Fruity. Welcome. We'll keep the giraffe life going. Until I decide that's too crazy. Work and devotions. Generation speed reduced by 10%. Not great. But easier to level up. Because he's gullible. That's a new one. We have not seen gullible. You can do farms. 
Okay. Now, should I do the second outhouse? Or should I do one of these? I'm two wood short. Now, I should probably let some of these trees grow instead of chopping them down immediately, but let's see if we have two in here. I don't. So I'm going to cut this. Do we have any of those crystals? I don't think I've seen any. We can sell stuff there. Okay, let's get this going. Extra wood, good. Also, did we get you in same day? Yeah, we did. Any poops? No. We can deposit pumpkin. I'm one mushroom short. Looks like I could grow mushrooms. We need another farm soon, too. We need a lot of things. I don't know if you could tell. We need a lot of things. Uh, some of the faith buildings would be great. Because these guys could go out and do stuff. What am I really short on? Money. Wood will hopefully speed up here. And then I don't want to wake them. It's kind of hard to target these ones. Let's maybe go do some fishing. Oh, we don't have a lot of fish in here, man. Oh, there's a big one, though. Oh, we got three out of that. Give me the whale. There it is. Nice. What does this guy want again? None of these things. These will be good food items, though, that we can make. I wonder if this isn't just straight up way better than the berries. I'll argue that it maybe takes a similar amount of time to harvest them. that big one on there. Okay. He does need those. Take this, caught it maybe 50 years ago, no use to me. Hey, what is that? Oh, nice. I need one more. Okay, I'm outie. I think I maybe have an extra one to give to him, but here we are.
Okay, let me educate him. Oh, I got another oldie up there. Kaz is going to be old too, so... So, Artie is old. I don't know if there's a way to uh, deal with that, really. So I'm going to queue up some of these, and then I also have a whole bunch of... Oh, wait. I have gold nuggets. I don't want to turn these into bars. So what do I do with the nuggets? Refined into coin. Huh. But not here. Oh, yes. My bad. My bad. We seem to be pretty stationary at, like, seven followers for the last little while, with the deaths and stuff. But, I mean, that's part and partial of... We're sort of maxing out what we're capable of doing right now. Okay, we could do a tasty fish meal. Deadly dish. 75% chance they die instantly. 100% chance of dropping valuable resources. I guess if we wanted to kill someone off, we could use that. Uh, illness. And actually, grass seems great right now. Because we got that trait. Okay. I don't think I have anything to clean. Base looks good. We'll try and let some of the trees grow. We'll try and use our nuggets to turn into coin there. And this should be fine. There we go. We'll clean these up. And there's even leftover food. Okay. So, is there anything else we need to do today? Let's check here. Yeah, I have enough mushrooms. There you go. Give Sozo, give Sozo. Excellent. But not enough. Bring him more and he'll show you how to brainwash those followers. Suppose you want something for your efforts. Of course, Sozo also pays his debts. Take this. Ooh, is that our last one? It is. Holy talisman. Talismans are mystical relics that the Red Crown can eat to unlock new fleeces. Unlock and equip fleeces from the altar in your temple. Let's go. I feel like that grass eater trait is going to be clutch for us. Okay, so which one do we want? Damage dealt increases after each kill, but resets when hit. Take double damage. Cures, uh, curses deal double damage and cost half the fervor, but melee weapon damage and health are halved. So it's all trade-offs. Gain a diseased heart every time a tarot card's drawn, but 100% of items will be lost if killed. Oh. All hearts will be replaced by 1.5 times the amount of blue hearts. Blue hearts, I think, can't be replenished. Four tarot cards at the start of a run, but none can be drawn after. 
you know, I actually, I actually don't mind that. I actually don't mind that. Because at the start of the run, it's most important anyways. Because then you get, like, maximum benefit. Can do another Doctrine. Let's maybe do uh, a working one. Inspire a follower to significantly increase their loyalty. Replaces the bless action. Okay, so this is a, a better bless. Or intimidate a follower to slightly increase their loyalty as well as make them work 10% harder for two days. So, do we want to boost loyalty faster? Or do we want them to work harder? I actually think intimidate is good here. Because we are getting a little loyalty buff. But the work speed, I think, is appreciated. Yeah, they love that. What could go wrong? So let's see. Intimidate. Loyalty up. Good timing. Right before they croak. Okay, so let's look in here and see. Missionary there. Fertilizer silo. Harvest totem. So that boosts growth speed. Catches birds. We probably get food. Deposit grass for fertilizer. Ah, oh, there we go. So we need tier four. Yeah, we need tier four. How many? Oh, I've got six left in this. That's a lot. Okay, let's do a fertilizer silo. Let's see if I can afford this. Maybe if this stuff is done. There we go. So we'll just put this one right next to the seeds. And then finally, I don't have to plant that. Get this bird out of here. I'll probably just wait till the next day as well and do a new doctrine. Empty this. Their pooping all seems to be concentrated in one spot now. Hey, what's that? What is that? What did I just get? Collect catch critter. What the hell? What am I catching? Okay, so we have nine beds right now. Oh, I bet you that's going to trigger after they snoozed. Maybe not. Let's get that one.
I think we're actually getting decently set up here. Becoming kind of self-sustaining. Oh, that's giving me... Okay. I think that's giving me... Um, souls or whatever that's called. Yeah, it is. Okay, sweet. So this should bring Kaz back. Stop dissenting. This is good. I think we can roll out. I should probably do a sermon. Then I guess we decide if we sacrifice again. Or how we want to handle that. We'll give everybody a bit of motivation. Dr. Fruity, welcome. Do better. Thank you. Jeez. We just land with stuff to do right now. Okay, it's on cooldown. Oh, okay, I need another stone one. I wonder if I have enough to build that. I need monies. Okay, that's gonna be a while. So we'll build one of those when we come back. I think we're good to go for today. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully this next run in here is a little bit more successful than the previous. And uh... Oh, look at this. Requires 12 followers. That's how they gate you. Neat. Requires 9. So this will be where we go next. I think we're actually right on track. I really feel like we're in a good spot here. Um, so we'll see you guys soon. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Bye for now. Wish me luck. And always remember, join the cult.